Hey, it's Steve Horn, Short Sales Done Easy here in Phoenix, Arizona. We are covering the five steps in the short sale process. We've already covered uh, steps one and two. Now we're going to focus on step three. Step three is having the bank order their appraisals. Whether you're dealing with a first and a second or just a first, appraisals need to be ordered within the first 30 days to move this process along. And that's our goal on our team and out of our Short Sales Done Easy company is to make sure that we have an appraisal order within the first 30 days. Why we need this done is because we need the bank to see the true value of the home. And when I list your house, I'm going to use an appraisal formula that all the banks use, whether they're short selling or foreclosing, they're going to use the same formula to price your home. And that's using three most recent active homes comparable to your house and the three most recent sold homes comparable to your house. So when I meet you and I come to your house and I discuss how we're going to price your home, that's the exact theory that we're going to use to come up with pricing your house. Because when we price your house on the listing appointment, we do not decide what your home is going to sell for. The bank is always going to decide what your home is going to sell for and they're going to use that appraisal price. We're hoping that the appraisal comes in line with what we've priced it at. Nine times out of ten, my appraisal is within $1,000 or $2,000 of what the actual bank appraisal comes in at. Not only do I list or short sales, I also list foreclosures for Bank of America. I've listed over a hundred foreclosure properties for Bank of America. I know how to appraise a home and that's the added value that I bring to the table when I come to list your short sale. So typically appraisals will never be an issue when we list your home. And if I've listed your home in line with the appraisals, guess what? We're going to have a contract within the first two weeks to three weeks because I've done my job and I've done my homework. And that's a very, very important step when we're dealing with appraisals and the bank's appraisers. FHA appraisers are going to be a lot more difficult than a normal conventional loan appraisal. If we accept a cash contract on your home, the appraisal is not going to become as much of an issue as it would be if, you're, if we're accepting a conventional or FHA loan. That's something that I'll walk you through in detail in our one-on-one -on -one, uh, presentation when we come and discuss short sales with you. Because the appraisal on the buyer side is very, very important as well, just not on the bank side. Um, so once we have the appraisals ordered, you'll get a call from the appraisers or you'll get a call from a real estate agent stating that they want to do a BPO or broker price opinion. A BPO is another version of an appraisal. They're still going to use the same formula, three actives, three solds to pass that along to the bank. Once the bank receives the appraisal report, the negotiator is then going to pass it on to stage four of the short sale process. And we'll discuss that here shortly. Remember, at Short Sales Done Easy, we do make your short sale done easy.